Zarya, she's a 5 stars hero with fire element and sorcerer class, offensive hero class. According to her base stats, she has high base stats and is good at attack and defense. Zarya has a passive, where she will deal extra damage or plus 100% to enemies with weaker elements, and receive reduced, minus 10% damage from stronger elements. This passive skill is quite good as a natural buff and counter element. First skill effect, deals 200% damage to all enemies. This skill effect is counted as a damage dealer, and the damage impact is not that big, so this effect will not have a fatal impact on the enemy. Second and third skill effect, if there are 6 or more fire shields on the board, damage is increased to 420%, and if there are 12 or more fire shields on the board, damage is increased to 500%. When compared to the effect of the previous skill, the effect of this skill has increased significantly, where the more red tiles on the board, the stronger and more fatal the impact of the damage, the effect even exceeds the damage done by Khufu and Sneferu, even close to Gosek. Attack score, A+, judging from her base stats and skills, Zarya has a fairly strong attack ability, this shows that she's a good attacking hero. Overall defense, A, judging from her base stats and skills, Zarya has quite a strong attack ability for a hero with average mana. This shows that her defense depends on her attacks, so this makes her very suitable to be in flank and tank positions. Titan score, B+, in Titan attacks, a deadly combination is needed in order to provide the highest attack score. The combinations needed are, elemental defense down, defense debuff, attack buff, high tile damage, and attack stack. Since Zarya doesn't have the skills needed to defeat a Titan, she is not recommended to be on a Titan attack team. Raid tournaments, A, judged based on her basic stats and skills, Zarya has pretty great attack skills, this makes her good enough to be used in various types of tournaments, especially in buff booster. Her overall grading is A. Conclusion, Zarya is a damage dealer who only relies on strength as her main skill. Even though she only relies on her strength, we can see that her strength is not just a figment of thumbs. This can be proven from the basic stats of her attacks which even almost touch 1000 without talent nodes, or limit breaks. Her skill mechanism is also very similar to Octro's, which also requires a certain number of red tiles to increase its damage impact. And not only that, she also has average mana generation, which I think is enough to prove that she has surpassed, Khufu, Sneferu, and even Gosek, where they all have slow mana generation. In my opinion, Zarya with her brute force ability, will be able to deal very fatal damage to her enemies. If indeed there are no significant changes to Zarya's skills during the beta process, then I can say that Zarya is a must-have hero.